There was nothing about the starry sky that night to suggest that strange and mysterious things would soon be happening. As unsuspecting muggles slept, a huge motorbike with a giant astride it tumbled down from the darkness. The giant, named Hagrid, left a blanket-wrapped bundle on the doorstep of number four, Privet Drive. Nestled in the bundle was a baby. Harry Potter, the boy who lived. For the next 11 years, Harry lived with his dreadful step-parents, the Dursleys. Until that fateful day, when he received the letter inviting him to attend Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Hagrid took Harry to Diagon Alley to purchase a most unusual list of school supplies. While at Gringotts Wizard Band, Hagrid collected a scruffy package from Vault 713, mentioning to Harry that the package, whatever it was, would be safer at Hogwarts. Soon after, Harry caught the Hogwarts Express from Platform 9 and 3 quarters and left the Muggle world far behind. Dumbledore stood up. This term, the corridor on the third floor is out of bounds to everyone who does not wish to suffer a most painful death. Harry sat beneath the sorting hat hoping that he would not be chosen for Slytherin House over Gryffindor. Not Slytherin, eh? said the hat in his ear. You could be great. It's all here in your head, and Slytherin will help you on your way to greatness. No? Well, if you're sure, better be... Gryffindor! Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry, I am Albus Dumbledore, your headmaster. Now, Hogwarts is full of secrets, Harry, so search behind every door. But keep in mind, not all secrets are rewarding. Only this morning, I took a wrong turn and stumbled upon a room full of chocolate frogs. But alas, when I returned, they'd been replaced by a, a nasty horde of fire crabs. Now, up the stairs and off to your lessons. Don't be late. Hey, Harry! Remember me? Ron Weasley? My brothers, Fred and George, have something to show you. Follow me! Hello, Harry. We can show you how to get around Hogwarts. As a first year, you have a lot to learn. Follow us for a secret lesson. I'll see you later in Defense Against the Dark Arts class. Good luck, Harry. to teach you how to climb. Run to the bookcase and don't stop. You'll climb up. Above the bookcase is a Bertie Bot's Every Flavour Bean. Collect all the beans you can find and meet us in the next room. Now, let's try jumping. 
Run to the ledge, then press the jump button to jump across. If you fall down, you can climb back up and start over. Meet us in the next room. We'll take the shortcut and meet you there. That's Peeves, the poltergeist. He's always causing trouble. Peeves doesn't like flashes, so watch your step. Now, Potter, you're ugly, but what can we do? in the hang of this. In Hogwarts, you'll find all sorts of wicked treats. To pick up a treat, just run over to it. Chocolate Fox boosts your energy. Bertie Bot's every flavour beans are fun to collect. We're collecting them too. We need 25 beans, Harry. Come back when you've got them all. Come see us and we'll show you the way to class. Cup and the Quidditch Cup. You better stay out of our way, Potter. Let's go, boys. <laughs> Move along, Potter. Keep away from this corridor if you know what's good for you. <laughs> Remember? Defense 
fights against the dark arts is through this door. Follow me. I am Professor Quirrell. Today we'll learn how to protect ourselves against the dark magic with the Fripendo spell. This is the symbol of the Fripendo spell. Now hold down the mouse button, make the same pattern, and then get a kill of the button. spell at the switch on the wall to open the d d door. Flipendo affects all sorts of things, such as this cauldron. Knock it over, Mr. P Potter. Potter. I am nearly headless Nick, the Gryffindor house ghost. Now, this is a save game book. When you touch it, your game will automatically be saved. The game will restart from this point, if you faint. You can also load a saved game from the main menu. Goodbye. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Cast your flippendo spell on this block to knock it out of the way.
This is a known Mr. Potter. They like to pester young wizards. Knock him on his backside to complete the challenge. They move quickly and can be quite a nuisance. Congratulations, Mr. P Potter. You completed the challenge. You collected all the challenge stars. Twenty p points for G Gryffindor. Now, hurry on to broomstick p practice. Back in their Gryffindor common room, Harry, Ron and Hermione talked about their exciting first days at Hogwarts. There was much talk about the break-in at Gringotts Wizard Bank. But there was little time to dwell on this, since Harry and his friends were expected at their flying lesson with Madame Hooch. I am your instructor, Madame Hooch. For your first lesson, you will fly through these magic rings. Control your broom with the direction keys. The speed up and slow down keys adjust your flight speed. Ready, Potter? On my whistle, then. Now let's see how you do with smaller wings. of height. quicker but you got through. Five points for Gryffindor. From now on you may practice flying at any time. You will find the option on the main menu. Time for your charms lesson now. Good day Mr. Potter.
learnt on my own. The spell I learned is Alahamora. It will open magically locked things, but don't get into any mischief. This is the symbol for Alahamora. When I stop, hold down the mouse button and make the same pattern. Then let go of the button. with that charm. Practice makes perfect, so give it another go.
young wizards. I am Professor Flitwick, and today you will learn the levitation spell Wingardium Leviosa. Observe the correct Wingardium Leviosa symbol. When I stop, hold down the mouse button and follow the pattern, then release the button. for a first year, Mr. Potter. Five points for Gryffindor. Try going slightly faster this time. Do pay attention, Mr. Potter. That's not what I taught you. You may now enter the Wingardium Leviosa challenge to practice the spell. Follow me, Mr. Potter. Cast Wingardium Leviosa on that statue, then move it onto that large plate. Wingardium Leviosa! Well done! Now go and collect the challenge stars. I'll meet you at the end. Good luck, Mr. Potter.
Congratulations, Mr. Potter. You completed the challenge. You've collected all the challenge stars. 20 points for Gryffindor. Now, off you go.
Malfoy's got a present for you. You better watch your step around here, Potter. Slytherins don't like Gryffindors. Bottom. This is my remember all. It tells you if there's something you've forgotten to do. Oh, it's telling me we have herbology class soon. Oh, I almost forgot. Watch out for Draco Malfoy. I saw him sneaking around here just a moment ago. to find it. Oh, my God. 
chocolate frogs are really good when you're low on... Again, having a tour of the castle, are we? This is as far as you'll be going. You won't get past me, no matter how hard you try. Oh, boo-hoo! Potter can't get out of the castle. These wizard crackers should make you feel better. They're surprisingly good fun. Here, catch! Over here. Hello, Harry. It's me, Hagrid. Good to see you. These are the Hogwarts Castle grounds, and I'm the gamekeeper, of course. Can't believe how quickly everything grows round here. Your friend Hermione's at the entrance to the greenhouse waiting for you. Drop round for tea later, after your lessons are done. lesson has just passed Professor Sprout's garden. I'll wait here for Neville. I think he's got lost again. Go on, Harry. You better get to the lesson.
Talk to Fred. Thanks for helping us out, Harry. Here's a wizard card then. Hope you don't have this one yet. Come on, George. We've got work to do. I am Professor Sprout. Today we'll learn the incendio spell, which is useful against all manner of dangerous plants. Observe the correct incendio symbol. Hold down the mouse button and follow the pattern. Then release the button. Great incendio, Mr. Potter. Five points for Gryffindor. Let's continue with the lesson, Mr. Potter. Incendio! That is an outstanding standing incendio for a first year. Ten points for Gryffindor. Let's continue with the lesson, Mr. Potter. Incendio! That is an outstanding Standing incendio for a first year. Fifteen points for Gryffindor. Let's continue with the lesson, Mr. Potter. <laughs> Almost, Mr. Potter. I believe more practice is called for. Now it's time for the incendio challenge. Through the doors, Mr. Potter. I'll watch you from the balcony. Those 
those are spiky bushes. You may cast incendio on them, but step back to avoid their needles. of venomous tentacular. Cast incendio to wilt it. Incendio! Oh, work. Now connect the challenge stars to complete your lesson. Away you go! Incendio! Oh! <gasps> 
kita
Nintendo. 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 Incendio. Incendio. Incendio! 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 Incendio!
Incendio! Congratulations, Mr. Potter. You completed the challenge. You've collected all the challenge stars. 20 points for Gryffindor. Now off you go. There you are. I hope you did well in your herbology class. I've got something I need to talk to you about. Be best to discuss it back at my hut. Meantime, you're gonna be late for your broomstick training. Off you go. Quite upset. Best go and see what he wants. Please help me. So long, Gotham has gone slithering to you, and you want me to give you his precious remembrance. I think I'll leave it somewhere for Long Bottom to come. How about up a tree? <laughs> think you can catch me? Come on, then, Potter. Remember all, Malfoy. You want the remember all back? See if you can catch it. And you better watch out for my bludgers! 
You've got my remember all back. Thanks, Harry. I'll be able to find my toad now. Come here, Trevor. Come back. I remember now. I left Trevor near the herbology class. There are plants there that eat toads! Mr. Potter, I'm Professor McGonagall, Deputy Headmistress of Hogwarts and Head of Gryffindor House. Although I do not approve of your chasing Malfoy about, I'll admit you have remarkable talent on a broomstick. Ordinarily, first-year students may not compete in Quidditch. In your case, we might overlook that rule. Harry, Gryffindor's first Quidditch match of the year is later this afternoon against the formidable Slytherin team. See you then. <laughs> <laughs> 